and welcome to today's On This Day in Tudor History. If you don't know me, if this is your first video with me, I'm Claire Ridgeway. I write Tudor history books and I also run the Tudor Society and the Anne Boleyn Files website. So all Tudor history uh, based. I'm a complete Tudor history nut. Okay, now yesterday, if you remember, I talked about Edward Stafford, the Duke of Buckingham, and his execution in 1521. Well, today I'm actually going to talk about his mother. For on this day in history, the 18th of May 1497, in the reign of that first Tudor monarch, King Henry VII, Catherine Woodville, Duchess of Buckingham and Bedford died and she was the mother of Edward Stafford. Now here are some facts about this Woodville woman just so that you know, uh, you know her background, who she was. She was the daughter of Richard Woodville, first Earl Rivers and his wife Jaquetta of Luxembourg. That made her the sister of Queen Elizabeth Woodville who of course was the consort of King Edward IV and uh, the mother of, of course, the princes in the tower, the mother also of Elizabeth of York who married King Henry VII. Uh, so yes, Catherine's niece was Elizabeth of York, so her niece was married to the king. Catherine Woodville was married three times. So we have her first husband being Edward Stafford's father, Henry Stafford, second Duke of Buckingham. Then after his execution, uh, she married Jasper Tudor, Duke of Bedford. Now you may have heard of Jasper Tudor. He has actually got that Tudor name, hasn't he? Well, he was uncle of King Henry VII, his brother Edmund Tudor being Henry VII's father. After Jasper's death, she married Sir Richard Wingfield and she was actually fined by King Henry VII for marrying Wingfield without royal licence. Catherine had four children with her first husband, Edward Stafford, third Duke of Buckingham, who we talked about yesterday and his rather sticky end. Elizabeth Stafford, who became Countess of Sussex. Uh, Henry Stafford, 1st Earl of Wiltshire, and then Anne Stafford, who became Countess of Huntingdon. Now, sadly, Catherine Woodville, even though she was this important woman, you know, marrying important men, having important children, uh, even though she was this important person, we don't know her final resting place. Um, whether it got lost in the dissolution of the monasteries, we, we don't know. Her resting place uh, doesn't seem to have been uh, recorded, we don't know it. So that seems very sad. So I hope you've enjoyed just this short video today, uh, just giving you some facts about Catherine Woodville, who was the mother of Edward Stafford, Duke of Buckingham, who we talked about uh, yesterday. I will see you again tomorrow. I'll bring you another Tudor history um, event. I'm doing these Tudor history videos every day for 2019, so there's plenty of Tudor history to keep you busy. You can subscribe to this channel by clicking around about there. You can hit the bell to be notified for um, of videos as they go live. Um, and please do give me a like. Thank you. See you soon. Bye bye.